tell tell us a little bit about because we were jamming before the show and you started jamming on kind of family systems and family stuff we bring into the workplace and i stopped you and i said that's it that's the topic i love it because it's so so very true yes so tell us a little bit about how you see that play out in workplaces how we bring that baggage and how we can sort of start to learn a little bit more about that okay so um, being a clinical psychologist, I do have, you know, I have the charity I run, but I also have a fair number of clients that come in. And so I will have clients on occasion come in because of workplace stress. And, you know, I have this boss. Oh, my gosh, she's such a. Uh, and um, I, I don't know what to do with her. And so we end up talking about, well, so my big my big jam, as you like to call it, is finding out what a person believes about themselves in that relationship. And it usually begins with I am. And so if this person, if their boss is, you know, demanding and critical, and then maybe what their belief system is, is I'm not good enough. And so we talk about, okay, well, where is your power? And then I also draw it into, okay, well, let's talk a little bit about your mom or your dad from, you know, and, and let's see, like, is this a familiar place? Because typically if something it feels familiar at work, it's because it fits in with this preconceived, pre-developed belief system that stems from our family of origin. 